everyone welcome to my youtube channel cracks are turning problems into solutions and this one is a revision video on statistics now we know that the di is merged with the qa part and i have been constantly saying this in my videos and in my shots as well that if you target for the di questions it will really help you to maximize your score in the quant section so statistics is a part of uh, data interpretation and you might not get it as a direct question like see the problem uh, with the people around is that they think that since a question is asked to what's the average age of the people who uh, give the mba examination somewhere more than 20 and around like the range goes up to 30s right okay and even 40s as well not i know there's no age bar come on here we'll talk about it some day later but the thing is that uh, i wanted to say that someone who is mature enough who is 20 plus will not get a question which is as easy as what is the average of these numbers or what is something this is true but do you think that the concepts the fundamental basis changes of course not standard 6 ka bachcha jo average mein ya statistics mein padhega like mod median stuffs like that aap bhi wahi padhoge you have to also solve the questions in the same way only the condition is that your questions are twisted in a story format and unhe ek direct question aayega that you have to find the mod of this number or the range of numbers but aapko ye as a direct question nahi aayega you would be getting a completely different thing you would be getting a long chart either tabular chart or you will get a bar graph where there will be lots and lots and lots of information उस इन्फॉर्मेशन से आप पहले नंबर्स निकालोगे आफ्टर फाइंडिंग आउट द नंबर्स देन यू विल हैव टू फिगर आउट कि लेट्स से व्हाट इज द डिफरेंसेस द एब्सोल्यूट डिफरेंसेस बिटवीन द इयर्स एंड वो डिफरेंसेस निकालने के बाद आप चेक करोगे कि उसका एवरेज क्या है या उसका मॉड क्या है या व्हाट्स द मीडियन नाउ व्हेन यू डू दिस दिस बिकम्स अ फाइव स्टेप प्रोसेस और वो बच्चा क्या कर रहा था ही वाज आल्सो कैलकुलेटिंग द एवरेज विद द सेम प्रोसेस or the mode with the same process but wo bas ek step pe kar raha tha so here's the difference try to understand even you know don't forget about standard 10 11 11 12 so you should forget completely completely forget whatever you have learned in standard 11 12 mathematics wo to aata hi nahi hai isme no question okay but uh, till standard 10 whatever we have learned in mathematics it's all this same even you would see that standard 10 mein somewhere you would see the quartiles and something like that but is statistics mein i haven't even seen ever any cat paper that paper any other mba exam also where quartiles or stuffs like that is asked okay so that's just a motivation for you people that agar aap apne concepts pe aur basics pe kaam karo then these questions are easy to solve okay all right so statistics so i'll not <laughs> teach you here how like uh, <laughs> the basics of it okay i'll just tell you what is what okay so the word mean in itself means average okay so how do we calculate the average the sum divided by the total number so if i have a sum of 100 and i have 10 elements whom i added up so it's 100 by 10 that is 10 10 is the average or the mean now what is mod definition the definition of mod is the maximum repeated thing so if there is a range of numbers yahan par hi dekh lo you can see that this number this number this number this number is getting repeated six times and this number is getting repeated three times so the number which is getting repeated the maximum the ski frequency sabse zyada hoti hai that number is the mod Now, किस तरह का क्वेश्चन फ्रेम करेंगे मैं अभी अभी इसी वीडियो पे एक क्वेश्चन आपको फ्रेम करके देती हूँ यू वुड बी गेटिंग अ क्वेश्चन वे यू वुड बी हैविंग अ बारग्राफ लेट्स से ठीक है एंड उस बारग्राफ में आपको रहेगा कि इन दी वाई एक्सिस यू वुड बी हैविंग द वैल्यूज और यू कैन से द सेल्स ऑफ एनी कंपनी ओके सेल्स ऑफ एनी कंपनी एंड दी एक्स एक्सिस में यू वुड बी गेटिंग द सेल्स ऑफ द कंपनी in various years ekdam basic question hai ye okay this is one of the most commonly asked question where a sales of a company is shown to you in the uh, bar graph and you have to determine answers based on that but question mein you would find that in the set of questions which you get for a particular graph you would see that one question might be from averages like um, means one question can be from median 
ओके सो यहां पर समझते हैं हाउ विल वी यूज हाउ विल वी गेट अ क्वेश्चन ऑन मॉड दे विल से दैट द डिफरेंस बिटवीन द डिफरेंस बिटवीन द प्रॉफिट टर्न ओके बिटवीन विच इयर्स इज हैविंग द मैक्सिमम फ्रीक्वेंसी और व्हाट इज द मॉड ऑफ द डिफरेंस इन द प्रॉफिट अक्रॉस ऑल द इयर्स सुनने में लगता है कि पता नहीं व्हाट काइंड ऑफ अ क्वेश्चन इज दिस व्हाट नंबर्स डू वी नीड स्टफ लाइक दैट एंड समटाइम्स पीपल विल आल्सो मेक इट डू अ मिस्टेक दैट दे विल थिंक द नंबर व्हिच इज गेटिंग रिपीटेड मैक्सिमम टाइम्स विल बी माय आंसर बट दैट्स नॉट द केस व्हाट दे आर आस्किंग यू टू डू इज कि आप इन दो ईयर का डिफरेंस निकालोगे देन यू विल बी सर्चिंग दिस टू नंबर्स सो दिस विल बी 1 2 देन दिस विल बी 3 दिस विल बी 4 सारे डिफरेंसेस निकालने के बाद आपका जो एक्चुअल सेट ऑफ डेटा है द नंबर डेटा सेट विल बी द डिफरेंसेस लाइक द डिफरेंसेस 10 15 10 ओके सो व्हाट व्हाट डिफरेंसेस यू गॉट लेट्स इमेजिन 10 15 10 12 13 15 10 ओके okay, दीस आर द सेट ऑफ डिफरेंसेस यू गॉट नाउ इन डिफरेंसेस मे से यू हैव टू चेक व्हिच डिफरेंस फ्रीक्वेंसी इज मैक्सिमम so the difference frequency maximum is 10 10 is repeated 3 times so that means the mod will be 10 to answer accordingly aapko nikalna hai okay so you have to just know the basic meaning of median this is a revision video i repeat so i'll not go into the depth and details but at least ye ek revision hai to revise your concepts ki exam mein ye question aa gaya to aap median aur mod ke beech mein confuse mat ho jana that's the most common mistakes i have seen people doing okay the third one is median what is median median is the number which comes exactly in the middle of a given range of numbers same question lete hain same differences lete hain differences ka data set ban gaya differences ka data set banne ke baad is data set mein se 10 15 10 12 13 is data set mein se you have to find out the median hmm step 1 arrange it in the ascending order so i'll arrange all the tens in the ascending order then i have 12 then i have 13 then i have 215s and ye mera set complete ho gaya now median mein do cases hain if the number of data given to you is even then we do it in a different way and when it's odd we do it in a different way right now jo example hum lekar chal rahe hain that has 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 odd wow very nice so odd hai to odd nikalna easy hai kyunki agar aapne ranking ke basic logical reasoning questions kiye hain then you must be knowing that the rank of a particular item from the left and from the right would be same if it is in the middle and this would be obtained only when you have you are having odd numbers of data so yahan par 12th is fourth from the left and fourth from the right both so 12 is the middle number and so we will say that the median of this range will be 12 because it is of course odd odd number of data but agar yahan pe main even number of data leti hu to kya ho jayega then we will take the two numbers which are in the middle for an instance isi data pe agar main add kar deti hu one more 15 तो ये हो जाएगा ऑड नंबर सॉरी ऑड से इवन नंबर एंड देन वी विल बी हैविंग 12 एंड 13 इन द मिडिल तो मीडियन ऑफ इवन नंबर्स इज कैलकुलेटेड बाय द एवरेज ऑफ द मिडिल टू नंबर्स सो 12 एंड 13 का एवरेज 12.5 होता है सो दैट वुड बी द मीडियन इन केस यहां पर एडिशनल एक आइटम हो तो ऑलराइट ओके सो दिस इज हाउ वी कैलकुलेट द मीन मीडियन एंड द मॉड नाउ समथिंग व्हिच आई वुड लाइक टू Add, add like add to the average part now so mean se utarte hain average pe and let's try to understand what additional things we should keep in mind when we have questions on average ab average ke questions hamare quant ke bhi ek essential part hote hain apart from just being a part of di so keeping that in mind let's try to understand ki average mein kya hota hai suppose an average of a particular group is given to you and usme koi add hota hai तो अगर दिस इज जस्ट कॉमन सेंस ओके नो फॉर्मूला अंडरस्टैंड इट प्लीज फॉर गॉड सेक इवन इफ इट्स वन डे फॉर द एग्जाम अंडरस्टैंड इट डोंट मग इट अप ओके एवरेज आई हैव अ लिस्ट ऑफ पीपल ओके लेट्स से 15 पीपल इन द ग्रुप एंड उसकी एवरेज मेरे पास गिवन है ओके दिस इज द एवरेज गिवन 
अगर एक और पर्सन इसमें ऐड कर दिया जाए इफ आई एड वन मोर पर्सन देन वॉट विल आई रियलाइज दैट द एवरेज वेंट अप ये देखिए क्वेश्चन में या तो आपको ये मेंशन होगा कि एवरेज ऊपर गया या नीचे या तो जिस भी पर्सन की आपने क्वांटिटी ऐड की है उसकी वैल्यू दी होगी ओके एवरेज ऑफ वेट ले लेते हैं फॉर एन एग्जांपल सो अगर उसकी वेट दी हुई है देन वी हैव टू डिटरमाइन कि एवरेज में इंक्रीज हुआ है या डिक्रीज एंड अगर सिर्फ इतना गिवन है कि एवरेज में इंक्रीज हुआ है देन वी हैव टू डिटरमाइन द वेट ऑफ द न्यूली एडेड पर्सन राइट so in case mein if the average is increasing then surely the person is going to be heavier than the average weight of the group similarly agar average niche jati hai then the person's weight is going to be obviously less than the average now related to this question only i have a trick for the averages the trick is that whatever average difference you have जो भी आपकी एवरेज डिफरेंस है कई बार आपको ये निकालना पड़ता है कि एवरेज में क्या डिफरेंस आया सो एवरेज का डिफरेंस इज एक्चुअली द टोटल डिफरेंस विच वी फाइंड आउट अक्रॉस द सम्स डिवाइडेड बाय द नंबर ऑफ ऑब्जर्वेशन विच वी हैव इस पर एक एक छोटा सा क्वेश्चन ले लें तो इट्स जस्ट लाइक दैट लेट से इसका रिवर्स क्वेश्चन लेते हैं द फॉर्मूला आई रोट आई विल बी टेकिंग अ रिवर्स क्वेश्चन ऑन इट reverse question in the sense that let me say that there were let's take very easy numbers 10 people okay uh, let's say that there are 10 people who are having the average of um, the average weight of let's say 50 kg okay so the average weight of 10 people is 50 kg and if i add another person to this then the average okay the average is changed or the average changes by 2 kg okay so the average increases by 2 kg if i to be more precise enough to so, agar average mein 2 kg ka change hai average mein 2 kg ka change hai to so, can we find out the total difference from here ki total quantity mein kitni change hogi ya us person ka weight kitna hoga of course we can so this is just a procedure okay question chahe kisi bhi way se aaye left se aaye ya right se aaye you need to know the meaning agar aapko ye nahi pata hoga na ki ye average difference humne kaise nikala i can bet on you this that over here you will you will just get confused ki mujhe ye upar rakhna hai ya ye niche rakhna hai this should be the numerator or this should be the denominator stuffs like that and as a hota hai not just because of the lack of knowledge but because of the time pressure and the exam panic situation in which all of us are there so that's why keeping that in mind please just a small request from my end aap samajh lo ise i am not asking you to learn this remember this i am just asking you to understand this ki agar koi bhi average difference agar nahi diya hai hame diya hai ki total sum of weight mein itna increase ho gaya ya suppose kijiye ki mujhe diya hai ki average difference bhi given hai and mujhe total difference bhi given hai to kitne people add hue main ye bhi add kar sakti hu uh, calculate kar sakti hu i mean so keeping that in mind i would be <laughs> closing the video for today and this was all about the revision on the statistics mean median mod and a little bit of discussion on the average based questions on quant as well if you found this video useful please like this video share it with your friends and of course subscribe to the channel if you are new to the channel and this was a requested video by alex bhaiya because he has made me my didi <laughs> okay he sorry i mean he has made me his didi so this is for you alex <laughs> okay so completing this video i would be up with more such videos i know that little days are left now and i don't want to freak you out on 1st of january at least so i'm planning ki i'll keep you cool on that day so study today okay i'll be right back with a new video until then please take care and thanks for watching